Welcome to an episode of Smack That Shit, also known as how to have a consistent golfing swing. A consistent golfing swing is going to help you tremendously in having more fun when you smack that shit. So why don't we show you while we play a hole of golf or two, we'll see what we get to, that you can have a more consistent golf swing. Each shot that we get to, you'll understand what makes it consistent and why, and that's it. Check it out. Okay, let's put the team to the ground. That's it. That's a peculiar position that you're what? in there. No. You look like a pelican. Are you being nasty? Well, I mean, what, my, what, what's like wrong with my position? like a gymnast or something. Bro, I'm a nasty perro. It's like whatever. I'm like fucking limber. I'm good. I'm feeling fancy. Wow. Look at that, man. That's good, bro. You were checking me out. That is very peculiar. Don't do that. <laughs> so, how are we going to have a consistent swing in the game of golf? Well, here's a great way to do it. Make sure that you're taking the club away the same way every time. That's important. A lot of people do it here and there and all over the place. Just take it back the right way. Take it back on a good plane. Take it back with your body. Use the big muscles. Use the big muscles. That's going to be a great way to have a consistent swing in the game of golf, especially off the tee. So I want to make sure that my thing is going low and slow. That's my ritmo. I'll even like mantra like, Low and slow and that's that rhythm. All right, I got a good line. Okay, good. I'm going to come up in here. I've been doing this new thing where I step into it like a batter's box situation. Like I kind of, I don't know, something happened in my life where I like that. So I'm going to try that right now. Good. And then it's on. Right there. Once I've done some shit right here, now boom, it's on. Let's make sure the backswing is low and slow and good. And let's put a good move on it. Let's have some fun. That's the game of golf. That's it. Wow. You ain't kidding. That's hammered. Holy smoke. Okay. Yeah, that was good. It's consistent. I made sure my backswing was slow, slow, and I used big muscles. Don't be nasty or do. But I think that the main part of being consistent, like you said, mm -hmm. do everything the same every single time. But how do you do everything the same every single time on autopilot? <clears throat> Yeah, my thing was, I think, to, to get it started, get that thing started the right way every single time. That's, for me, important. What's yours? I think if I want to do it the same every single time, then I must do something the same every single time. So I feel like everything's just connected. Yeah, I like that. And if I connect everything, then I can't be up here or over here. Mm -hmm. I, I just swing it the same every time because my arms are connected to my body. My elbows are close together. So in other words... In other words, are you using your big muscles, your big bodies, your body? Well, no, my big muscles are here. Oh, but you're using your body. Yeah, kind of. Okay, I like it. So I just want to put everything together. Connect everything. Yeah, bro, connect four, connect the dots, that's it. And then just turn back and turn forward while being completely connected. I'm and that. keep my head down. What is Shaw? It's pretty consistent. That thing didn't move at all. That was beautifully struck. That's consistency. That was doing low, the same thing over and over. Beautiful, and over. runny. I was very turned on by that. Runny, like you like your eggs. Ew, what is that? Runny. Who even says that? Why would you do that? Do you ever order your eggs runny? Sunny side up, right? When grandma makes huevo tibios. Bro, oh. huevo tibios, nobody knows about that, man. Unless you're Latino. Yeah, I know. Let me uh, put a little bit of pan. You put some huevos revueltos. Is that your what's your what's your number one breakfast of all time? Oh, bro, don't get me started on that, bro. Are you like, kidding me? If you had to choose one breakfast as your last one ever, Andale, perro. can I interest you? In a... You can always interest me in a little less. Listen, man, I had it for Christmas morning. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. um, My favorite breakfast ever in the world. You ready for this one, man? Mm -hmm. Sausage, bacon, <laughs> eggs. You're disgusting. <laughs> Sausage. Why, wait, 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 wait. What is, why, why would you say sausage first? I'm just rattling it off, dog. This is my show right now. So okay. why don't you just sit back and relax, right. bro? Sausage? It's sausage, bacon, eggs, hash browns, okay? That's important. Sausage, bacon, egg, and hash browns, bro. Then you have sourdough toast, and you have some mantequilla. You put the butter, but you yes. also put the strawberry preserves. That's it. Boom. You got to have two pieces of that. Then you have to have a Bloody Mary, a spicy Bloody Mary, oh okay? God. You got to have it, like a good one. And then you have some limonada. Do you also, have a Bloody Mary or Bloody Maria? No, no, no. I have a Bloody Mary. I'll put the vodka on that one. Wow. I don't care about the key. It's Bloody Mary. That's it. Then 
Then you have the lemonada. Then you have the orange juice. So it's limonada and Bloody Mary. It's orange juice, lemonade, Bloody Mary, a double espresso for cheer, a double espresso for cheer. So that's how you started the, the double espresso. Boom, toma, a la verga. Boom, that's it. Man, that it is goes, a massive breakfast. Oh, Theo, I'm fucking 6'5", 255, deep down <laughs> on the inside, bro. Seriously, I smash food, bro. I promise you. you sound like Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice. Me? I'm 6'5", baby. 6'5", 225. I'm a nasty perro like that. So, sausage, bacon, eggs, hash browns, sourdough toast, mantequilla with the strawberry preserves, with the limonada, with the oranges, with the Bloody Maria. But you started off with a double espresso. That's the ritmo. I hammered that, bro. The whole thing. That's wow. it. Mm -hmm. You asked. I'm you really, asked. I'm already exhausted. You man. asked. Entero, dog. You know what I like? White toast. Sourdough is white. White toast, no butter, and a glass of water. <laughs> Why you did that? <laughs> That's terrible. No, I'm just kidding. That is a good breakfast, but I think... Uh, Toma. A good pozole. Hold on. A good pozole for breakfast. Mm -hmm. Chorizo and huevo. But chorizo con huevo is oh, always man. that rico. That's, that's next level, though. That's always that rico. Because it's not always there. But all that other stuff, you can you can get easily. So you really had it for Christmas morning? Hey, Diego, I took Santa. photos. I have the whole bit, bro. You took photos of it. I had to. It was so good and so well made and so fantastic. And I was the happiest person on the planet. I swear to goodness gracious. You made it? I made it. I whipped it up. I made it my own stilo, my own ritmo. I did the whole thing. I had the Bloody Mary mix, like that's it. Tabasco, that's it. The bacon. I didn't do the celery because that's whatever. And then boom. Wow. I woke up, bro. I had my double espresso. So, uh, I didn't even know you knew how to cook it was anything. Some. Are you kidding me, bro? Did you just hit yours like gone, gone? Sorry. Oh, no. That's I nice. drove way past yours. I didn't mean too much. <laughs> wow, the sun is setting. It's very romantic right now. Calm down. The sun is setting. The year is setting. Look at this. All right. That is a nice sunset. Okay, how far we got? 175 yards. Oh, hold on. I have a later beamer. 175 up the hill. At least. I'm going to see what's up. Where's that pin? That thing is blue and back. Over the it's bunker? back yeah. and blue, dog. Get it? Back and blue. You didn't get it? Hey, what does your kid call his new toy at, for Christmas? A uh, stelescope. A oh, stelescope. Okay, I have a beep in his home then. What do you think it was? 181. Pretty close. 178. But it's going up the hill, mine. You have to factor that in. The ball does not fly as far. It doesn't, but... I don't even know if I want to hit it all the way there. That's a risky shot because the bunker's there. So, okay. again, consistency. And frequency. That's how you do it. Like attached. That. Consistency back, and frequency. Turn through. Okay. Elbows together and head down. Codos juntos, man. Mmm. A little right. Just squirt. Ew. What? 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 Why did you say that? Uh, what, what, that's that's how you talk to the ball. Really? Yeah, like squirt up there and out of there. Ew. God, <laughs> you are a disaster today. I didn't say it. You did. <laughs> but your reaction. Is that a normal reaction that you get when you say, never mind. <laughs> We're going to leave that alone. <laughs> You're sick. Wow, you hit your far. Uh-oh. What's the thick away? We have company. Who's company? Uh-oh. Three's company. Not all of them. Come on, knock on my door. Uh oh. Here it comes, Mike. I think I'm waiting for you. Jose has the ability to put the hex on the, <laughs> on the rhythm of a chair. I don't have my thing, Doc. What did you lose now? My little magnetic rhythm. Oh, you don't? Know? There's Jose. So, oh, fine, boy. whatever. He's put coming to now. get you. All right. You okay. Shoot it? Hi, Jose. Oh, sir. Jose. You want to be on national television? <laughs> he laughs. He laughs and crashes yeah. right into uh -huh. the tree. <laughs> All right. As he's looking. Bye. All right, Mike. Here's what I see, people. This is good to know. The top of the bunker is 130. The flag is 148. Do some good math. That's 18 yards. 
So I know I got 18 yards to mess with. That's what I got. 130, 148. Is that the number? It was 148 to the flag. 130 to the top of the bunker. So I got like 18 yards. That's okay. it. All right. So it's going up 148. I'm going to add 10 yards. I'm adding 10. So it's really 158 to the flag. Okay. Now I don't want to fly it all the way up there like that. So I'm going to do what I like to do. What do you like to do? I like to take one extra club and swing smooth. That is another reason that you can have a consistent swing. Because if you start going crazy and you're doing Formula One shit and you want to go in sixth gear, your whole swing changes because you're doing extra. Mm. If you take more stick, let the club do the work for you and take a nice, smoother, better swinger, you got a better shot. You have a better chance of being more successful. And that's what we're trying to do, right? Consist right. Consistency and frequency. Right. Come on, man. All right, let's see it, Mr. Consistent, Mr. 3000. Good. Okay. And action. Here we go. Let's see if I can also, the ball is above my feet. I don't yeah. have like a super perfect flat lie, so mm -hmm. I'm going to take way more club and just take it easy. Here's my new little ritmo. Okay. In three, two, one. Let's see it. Right there. Oh, that's good. Yeah. I was able to zoom in all the way into that. Okay, now here's the thing that happened. Mm -hmm. I took dead aim at the flag, which I didn't think that this was going to affect it too much, but because the ball was a little above my feet, right. it started pushing it that way. It's exactly what happened, but I took more stick. I kept it nice and calm and tranquilo and very, very nasty, connected, like you say, it's McDonald's. Yeah. If you didn't know, his visor's from McDonald's. He's Make going to work out. later tonight to survive and yeah, provide for the family. So, uh. Okay, let's go. Uh, the Mick DLT, dude. One of the greatest inventions in American history. You never had one of those. Whoa, the camera is just wonky. There we go. What do you mean I never had a Mick DLT? Have you had one? What's it called? Mick DLT. And what is that? Go in and ask for one. Oh, <laughs> so what is it called? Mick D. I got that, man. I got the acronyms, but what's it made of? Oh, well, you got to go in and find out. I can't oh, you it. squirted it over here. Oh, by the little mini Christmas tree. That's it, not a golfing ball. Where'd it go? I can only drive the golfing cart so close before the golfing gods beep at me. Come on, let's go find it. Come on, let me get a club <clears throat> and a putter. Did it stay in? I mean, it's not in someone's backyard no i know but i thought it was like on the grass oh all right let's see what i can do Wanna is that a bonsai it? tree i heard that oh my here let me hold that ew wow <laughs> what a disaster <laughs> wow it looks very nature this is a hard shot but all i have to do is just get it on the green if i make bogey i'm okay with you look like you're in costa rica hold please Hey, take it easy. Oh, hold on. I'm going to climb the mountain like a billy goat. Oh, this is for the people, man. You can't even see the ball. There it is. Okay. Ready? That's it. Excuse me. Here we go. I got to hit it low uh -huh. and just punch it. Oh, I'm trying to do my best, Spielberg. Come on, man. I'm there. Holy shit, you made it? No, seriously. Oh, man, that was good. Take it easy. That's all right. I know it's okay, but that was as good as you could do. It's pretty good. Let I'm going to putt for par. Let me get that thing. All you need is a chance, right? Uh -huh. No mas dame chance, way. <laughs> That's all you need in life. How about you, you go to the green? There? I'll drive. Uh, hold on. I already got my steps in for the day. I'll take a ride. Just give me one second. One minute, please. Mm. Nasty perro. Look at that burn on this thing. Mine you're, already not really, you're not really smoking it. Well, it's because you're disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> All right. 
birdie putt and a par putt. <clears throat> what else can you ask for? I think the biggest thing that we learned there was to add a ton more yards. Mm -hmm. Listen, I'm calling it a ton, whatever. Add a ton more yards. Yeah. Take more stick. Mm -hmm. Keep the swing consistent. I'm telling you, when you go lunatic crazy, you know what I'm saying? When you're like, you're exiting the atmosphere or some shit. Come on, man. No. Mm. These clubs have angles. There's enough masa here. Just su uh, su uh. Come on, man. Okay. That's a good speech. Wow. That was elite. Elite. All right. Let's see. You got a 30 footer. This was just very good. I mean, it ended up being very good. Let me face my pitch. All right, please, diez, me cago en Dios. Here, I got one. Trim in. Fix that shit. Choy it. Stab oh, you choy it? Shit. Fill that shit. Why are you doing it, man? <laughs> Why are you Come on, that? man. Well, you over here being so disgusted. I'm taking my time because I want to make sure that the green is good for the people. That's it. I'm going to keep this. Thank you very much. Wow. I might have to ash this because I don't want it to get on the green. Ash that, man. Ash that shit. If you want to smoke a cigar, there's no problem with that. It's okay. You have a glass of whiskey, you smoke a cigar, you live a life. But put it elsewhere. Not on the security of the green. This is a very sacred place. <gasps> Listen, if it's not so crazy, you can just do it like that. Golf gods are watching. Holy. Okay. This is a little bit uphill. Can you see that? That's going up the hill. Viewers. Yeah. Right away. I know. All right. It's probably a little touch uphill. I come down here on the bottom, I can see that it's coming this way to me because we were coming up the hill. So naturally it's probably sloped like this. You can't quite see it, but I'm going to air, air on that side. I cannot stand this thing. I don't care if you keep it in or take it out, but like, whatever, I can't stand it. I get behind the hole, I squat down. Okay, good. I look at what my line might be. It looks like if I hit a ball to right here, Earth will take it where it belongs. That's my line. That's it. Come on. That's it. Walk around the person's imaginary line. Don't uh -huh. step in his world. That's very, very maleducado. And away we go. I line it up because I like it. I almost fall over. That is way too many. I love it. I maximum love it. And away we go. Shoom. Go one. I take another practice while I look at the hole. And then all I do is repeat that stroke. Let's see what happens. Mm. Mm. Okay. That hill pushed me down. This hill kept me straight. So it ended up being a straight putt. Listen, because I'm in your way, uh -huh. let me just finish this off. Okay. okay I'll use good. this time to. That's good. I have a little ritmo that I like to do. Okay, that's good. And then make the ball end over end. Knock it in the hole for a little parita dust. It. Oh, my man. Dive. Oh, my God. I hit my paw way too hard. Mm. Muy bien, tu cinco. Guess what, people? This is live and direct. Golf happens. I'm not concerned. I hit it too hard. Stroker, stroker, putter, 
door. Clean it up. What are you doing? There you go. I know. Here's I don't know why I hit it like a lunatic. Should we play another one? Come on, let's play another one. It's good. Okay. I'll take this. Bring the cameras. Or should we just leave the camera here and do their thing? So, people, what did you learn there? Hmm? I bet you do that a lot. It happens. I haven't practiced my three footers in a long time, and evidently I just got bit by that. So, I'm going to remember that it's delicate. I have to hold my finish. I have to remember a lot of things, which evidently I forgot that. All right, new hole. R4. Up the hill. 370, 380. Look at that. All right. Key to consistency. Key to consistency. Show the people what is the key to consistency. Connection and consistency. They go together. Connection. I love it. Consistency. Muy bien. Hammered. You look very connected there. Yep. <clears throat> like Pac Bell. Ooh. Okay, people, guess what? The past is the past. The present is the present. And the future is whatever. Forget about it. You missed the putt. I missed the putt. Whatever. Make up for it that you learn from your mistake, but you forget about it and keep it moving. Yeah, new hole. Don't try to chase that putt because then that's what happens. People miss a putt like that. I know. And they're furious. Furious. They that get was to the nothing. tee box. Oh, shit, bro. I missed the two footer. <laughs> I did too, bro. Yeah. Then they get the driver and they try to hit it as hard as they can. It goes in the hill. Mm -hmm. And then it's just a compounder. Yeah. Compounding interest. Compound interest. Except you ain't getting paid. Uh, in. Okay. Let's do my little thing that I like to do right now. I love it. That's it. Okay. Muy bien. Good. Three, two, nasty. Damn. I just hammered. That might have outdrove me. And you hit an iron. I hit a two iron. That's your driving iron. This thing is so good. There's a way to hit every club in your bag. I know that the driving two iron, smooth. It has a ton of Masahiro Tanaka in it, which means the ball's going to go. Put a good swing on it. Let the club do the work. Mm -hmm. I'm not trying to do nothing. Just hit the center oh of the club. Oh, my God. Dude almost made that. Oh, wow. Good shot, dude. Oh, got some golfers behind. Okay, okay. How about so you hit that two iron in lieu of your driver. Listen, this is a little baby hole. There's no need to rip a drive up there to who knows where. I know and I like to be able to hit a golfing ball in play, allow myself to use the clubs I know how to use, take a good full smooth swing, get it up there and play golf. You know, I know I haven't practiced my little 30, 40, 50, 60 yard shots a lot until i do that to get it in tight i'm gonna make sure that i swing the golfing club the way it's intended to be swung which is smooth and nasty nasty fancy nasty fancy look at these are good shots mm -hmm. okay that, that guy's 150. so because we're so close what is that 152. so check it out Here's a good way to do it. Oh, you're at 150. You could be, I don't know, wherever you're at. But if you get here, you just walk one yard. Each step is one, two. Good. 152 to the middle. I got a red flag, so I'm going to subtract 10. That means 42 probably or so to the hole. Okay. Now, that being said, it's a little bit up. Oh, my God. I stupid. I didn't bring my thing. Use mine. I'm not going to use it. Whatever. It's too late. But it's a little bit up, so I'm going to add 10 more. 52. 152. Okay, what am I gonna do? Take extra club, swing it smooth. I can hit a nine all day long, but I'm gonna smooth an eight because I like the way it is. 
So you're hitting an eight iron. I'm smoothing an eight iron. Okay. I have more than enough stick, but I think this is the one. And let's do it. Good. I got a new little thing I like. Three, two, one. Okay. Tad short. I kept it safe. a little clippy, a little short, but guess what? I'm going back up to the hole. Yeah. I'm not ripping it off the world. I didn't hit a great shot, but I'm right there. That's where you want to miss. Though. I agree. And now you have a short little. And listen, the whole point of this is that golf is a game of imperfections. You're imperfect. Okay. How do you get around being imperfect? Keep it smooth. Keep it gangster. Okay. Well, I probably have 130 then because you had 154. Right? That's exactly what I have. So I probably have 135. I'm going to hit a pitching wedge low. Just play it on my back foot, but still feel that connection. Go up, mm -hmm. come down. Real low, back foot, connected, head down. Get That's up there. Piece. Yeah, it's pin high. Well, it's definitely past pin high. Oh, that's pretty close. You want to fill that? Thank you, sir. I can, I can promise you this. you got a funny power. It's all right. Hey, it could be worse. I agree. I'm You're putting. Wrong. You're wrong. Good job. I'm putting. I have a chance. They're going to get to see my downhill putt uh, method, okay. which is very... Jack Nicholas, 1986 Masters. This might be the same exact putt he had in your life. Except for there's <laughs> a few tens of thousands of people lighter. Oh, you don't know that the people watching, that's, that's my gallery. How about that? Oh, you have a thing going on over here that I don't know about? The people that are going to watch this video? Oh, you're right. Oh, you were thinking about the people like that. Look at that. Everybody! Everybody, hey. everybody, what is that? Grab a putter. Oh, oh, oh. No need to be crazy. Yeah, just get it on the green and putt. Listen, you you're, putt. you're not going to go home and tell your lady, hey, I chipped in from eight feet off the green. <laughs> so, like, what's up? Yeah, she's going to be like, what did you just say? Uh huh. Well, your kid. He's smoking weed at school and he's 11. <laughs> yeah, but I chipped in. But I chipped in, mama. Okay. You want to go first? Yeah, sure. Give yeah. me this thing so we can do it. You're furthest away anyway. Everybody, furthest away goes first. And it doesn't matter if you're on or off the green. It's whoever's furthest away goes first. That's how it's go. Now, does it matter a ton? No. Play ready golf. That's a thing. Whatever. But for the sake of production... Okay, so I have a screamer. Yeah, that's lightning fast, man. Screamer down the hill. Mm -hmm. I just want to start it on the line and let the gravity and the hill do everything. So I'm just going to tap it, get it rolling, and just let it go. Okay. Make that little jacuzzi around it. Oh, your jacuzzi. Let's jacuzzi see. with people full, full of people drinking Miller High Life. Watch this. My people drink Corona Premier, right? Slow down, slow down, slow down. Oh. oh, that's pretty good, dude. That's pretty good. It hasn't stopped yet, but it was good. I care the angle, bro. I care the angle of the dangle for so long. Not mark terrible. Cautious. At least I have an uphill putt now. Okay. I'm going to allow you to mark with your tee because I'm not going to hit that. Oh, I hate it. A ver, looks fairly straight to me. Is it any different putting off the other grass? When you're this close and the grass is cut pretty tight to the earth, you know, like very finely cut, uh -huh. it's not going to make much of a difference. Okay. You just got to put a good little pop stroke on it and get it up near the hole and do your best to make a par no more than five. Okay. No more than five. This actually moves a little this way. I see it. So I'll aim a touch to the right. 
And let's see if we can do something nasty. Muy Get bien. Jacuzzi. Ma. Okay. And muy bien again. Okay, Mr. Oyo. Let's see what happens. Uphill, give it a good pop, no problems. That's it. Uh oh. Okay, that hopped and jumped and skipped and did a bunch of crazy stuff. But whatever. Me or you? I look like I'm away. We're was... still putting up to the hole. There's a bunch of shit on my golfing ball. Okay. One cup on the right. Good. The ball should dive in to the left. Make a good stroke. You see it going left? Well, how can I not? Okay, do your thing. This was so downhill fast all this way. Okay. Yeah, I see a ball moving a little bit to my left. Hopefully, I'm correct. Huh? Get up here, put it, flat it, check it, get it, stroke it, and that's it. Oh! Straight. Didn't move, huh? Well, the ball's behind the hole. Might have moved a touch, but not as a cup. Tap it in for five. Good. Who's next? I feel like mine is going to go right. Not left. We have kind of similar. Find out. We're, I mean, we're, we're, we're live and direct, figuring it out together. Head down. Knock it in. Ooh. <laughs> Dead straight. Tap it in. I will get the flag. Listen, everybody. You have to understand something. This is golf. This is how it works. This is how it goes. Some go in, some don't. Some are short, some are long, some this, some that. You just learn. You grow. You are frequent. You are consistent. You try and keep your stuff together because the ball didn't go too crazy here. And you can keep it moving and have more fun and shoot. 10 shots better just off thinking nastier. Now, would you like to go maybe one more hole? All right, three? let's go. Let's go. Hey, who are they? Can you grab that? Yeah, I can grab that. Is that an Eskimo? <laughs> Excuse me, Mrs. Eskimo. Oh, look, it's Eskimo and Black Swan. Who would have thunk? <laughs> Holy moly, how lucky are we? It's like Disney characters. <laughs> oh, look, she has a little beanie and Does everything. she has a Manolo beanie on? I mean... That fur better be full. <laughs> She's like, full. That better be full fur. Oh, look, high heels and everything. Everyone, this is very, very, <gasps> very surprised. Oh, uh oh. -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's not rolling. Huh? It's not rolling. No. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> okay, we'll turn we it this way. To, we don't want any evidence of this. Okay, well then fine. Do we'll you, make sure to cut you out. Yeah. Oh, okay. We'll do that. Do, in you, post. do you need us for something? No, we just. I wanted to get some pictures, but it's like really, really hazy. Yeah. Oh, hazy. Okay. Will you to be here for a little while longer? Um, Perfect. Okay, fantastic. Okay. <laughs> we'll see you, Charlie. Who was that? <laughs> Never seen those two women in my life. <laughs> okay. Peculiar, right? They just showed up. They didn't have any golfing clubs. Yeah, what was that? I don't know. We're on a golfing course. Oh, maybe they're here for the Grand Prix. All right, par three up the hill. Let's go. Let's go. Easy game. Losing light a little bit, but whatever. Play it at 170 yards, correct? Is the pin in the front? No, middle. White. The pin is white. So we'll do a seven. You do seven, I'll do six. <laughs> See you, Charlie. She looks like the, the guy from The Godfather. <laughs> you know, uh, the guy that fixes the light bulb and then gets shot. Forgot his name. Don something. Don Barzini. No, Don Barzini was another guy. Anyway. All right. Up the hill. Mm hmm. Up the hill. Not the easiest of shots. Let me tuck in my pocket before I lose it. This is a full seven iron. What are they? You do that. You're going to hit a five iron smooth, let me guess. 
What do you know? Five iron smooth. This is the whole point of the golfing video to teach the people. Yeah, I just feel like I can't control that distance. That's so okay. I'm going to still smooth, s swing smooth, but just with a seven. Listen, iron. Jimmy, not everyone is the athletic specimen that you are, man. So come on, man. Uh. That's just fine. It's going to get a kick on the green. Pretty close. I mean, it's far enough, that's for sure. Listen, I tell you this. You get up to near pin high, that's a good move, mine. This might be a little right. It actually stayed dead straight. And you know what I forgot to do there is connect. Mm. I was thinking about the fact that. happens that in the game of golf. That happens in life. You forget. So you learn from your mistakes. Still hit it straight. But I think that the habit of being connected just yeah. kicks in. All right. Autopilot. Here's the habit of smooth five. How about that? Smooth five. Go swing. Do something kind of nasty. All right. I like it. I'm going to stick to my new little thing that I like to do for whatever reason. Okay. Three, two, one. Oh man, go. It's a okay. little short. It's a little short because you I'm it. swinging very, very like soup, like almost too smooth. Yeah. So that's fine. We're going to get up there and we're going to use our little short game weapons. I'm swinging extra smooth. It I want, listen, straight. I'm trying to play as if we are, you know, teaching that people are like, oh, I can do that. I can do that. Well, you're limiting damages also. You Correct. know that if you take a less club and hit it harder, things can go wrong <clears throat> as opposed to, I mean, you'd rather take a five iron and hit it completely straight like you did than hit a seven iron and have it go left or right because you're swinging out of your shoes. Exactly. That is what I am trying to preach the teach that, listen, you're playing golf. We're doing this. We're filming this. The whole point of this is so you can see like, okay, I can do that. It's okay. It is okay. Yours is great. I'm not concerned at all right there. I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to take my putter again because a lot of people need to understand that they can do that. Now, here's what I did. I learned from my mistake the last hole. Hit it a little harder, maybe. Learn. It's Golf is learning. Knowledge. Constantly learning. I'm going to assume that mine got on, but oh, yeah, I'm good. You good? We're both good. We're just off the green. Yeah, but we're, you know, we're, we're near it. We're on it. We're good. Easy par. All right. It looks like we're similar distance away. We're here at yours. Do okay. It. This goes up and slides this way. This is kind of a funny putt, but whatever. Funny how? Funny like a clown. Like I'm here to amuse you? Amuse me. All right. Let me ask you something. It's, so funny it's gonna me. go up and then it's gonna feed down. I can feel that with my feet. I can see that. So let me go over here. All right. It looks like if I hit it to right about here, the earth will take me into the hole and a ball, if I'm gonna make it, it's gonna go in, in this area. Not trying to make it, but that's my idea. Let's see if it works. In other words, that's that ritmo. And that's <laughs> it. Thank you for that. That was very, very generous. Okay. Uh, yeah. Up and through and away we go. Good. Now I just repeat that last one on the line. Give it a little more masa and let's see what happens. Oh, that's good. That's good. Ah! Oh, man. Good par. Thank you very much. I'm going to give you that one. You give me this one? I'll give you that one. So thoughtful. I think you know how to do it. Hopefully. <laughs> that is the first par I made in so long. But that's okay. Because there's always more holes. There's more holes to play. You learn. Wow. This thing's going to snap. I know. You saw mine. So I need to aim six feet north of the... The reason he said that's good is because 
It was close enough where it's like, okay, you'll make that probably. Let's speed up play. That's what that means. Come on, man, do it. I kind of love it. I kind of love it. Hurry. Muy bien. Very well read. Very well read. That's good too, right? That is absolutely good. <laughs> Knock it in for whatever reason. I don't care. Muy bien. Easy part. Okay. What did we learn today? About a consistent golfing swing. What you want to do is you want to make sure you can repeat it. When you're going crazy, you can't repeat crazy, okay? But you can repeat smooth, okay? Slow is smooth, smooth is fast. Take more stick, be more smooth, and be more consistent. You take this into 2024 or whatever year you're watching this, I promise you, you're going to be nastier. You're going to play a lot better golf. That's that ritmo. Jimmy Tropicana and Manolos. That's it.